Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Shalane. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. I have just turned up to my brother's place. I'm dropping off a couple of things for him, but I had a job interview this morning. What well, was actually in the afternoon? I had a job interview this afternoon. So yeah, fingers crossed. And then I have another one tomorrow, but I thought I would start vlogging. I wasn't gonna vlog this week, but I don't know what else to do if I don't vlog. I was going to do a makeup tutorial, but I just am not quite, like, not quite vibing a makeup tutorial. So I thought I'd just start vlogging. It's, like, mid midweek already. It's Wednesday. But um, also tomorrow I have a fun kind of day. I am going to a gifting suite with new denim, which is really exciting because the last gifting suite that I went to Oh my gosh, the lighting is not really... There we go. The last gifting suite I went to was Nimble Active, and that was last year, I think, or the year before. I think it actually was the year before last year, um, and which was such a cool experience. The last one I went to was Nimble Active, and Millie Ford, I think that was her name, Millie Ford was there. She's like this massive, massive creator and also actress. And I was like, what am I doing here if Millie Ford is here? So that really brings back the memes. That was my first kind of like influencer experience, especially when I was feeling that imposter syndrome. So yeah, this time around, I'm not going to be feeling those feelings. I don't even know who's going. So it's just going to be like a very chill, gifting suite. And I'm not going to like let my nerves get to me. I don't know why I always do that when it comes to these kinds of events. We're going to go to the new denim gifting suite tomorrow and then... I have my job interview afterwards, and then I have um, Pilates class in the evening, so it's a really full-on day. So yeah, welcome back to the vloggy vlog. Um, <laughs> I don't really know what else to say. I'm wearing my glasses. I never wear my glasses, but actually I'm starting to feel like maybe they would be cute with some outfits. I just made it to the shops. You're going to have to deal with me vlogging on my phone for now because I don't have my camera with me and I randomly decided to vlog. But I'm just returning something. Oh, no, not returning. I'm exchanging a size at Uniqlo. And then I'm going to go and drop off a gift to my friend. Um, like a care, It's like a little care package. She's going through a bit of a breakup. And I could tell it was really affecting her. So I wanted to like give her something thoughtful. And I just got a few cute things put in a box. And I'm going to deliver that to her house. It's kind of a surprise. She doesn't really know what's in it or what it is or anything like that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do this exchange and then go and drop off the gift. And then, oh, sorry. And then I'm going to head home. Because that's all I had to do today. <laughs>
spot, but I don't know if it's like legit. Two hours, eight to six p.m. Monday to Friday. It is ten thirty. I I'm just going to park here. It's fine. Okay, cool. So we'll stay for four hours. There's literally a cafe right there. Slay, slay the day away. Um, and the time is, oh, you're on my phone. 10.33, so I'm going to pay for the parking, go have something to eat and chill, and then go to the gifting suite. Sounds good. And then hopefully there's a toilet in there as well, because I need to pee. This area is so nice and green. <laughs> It's really probably super annoying. Um, yeah, I'm back in my car. I that was really quick. Why did I think it was gonna go for like four hours? Um, luckily, I only paid for two hours parking. Gifting suite is like you kind of go in there, like they set up all their new stock or like new collections that are coming out, and they showcase them. Um, and you get to like take photos and try things on, and then um, you like usually they give you a gift. Um, and there's so many beautiful pieces. I love new denim. Like, they're quite underrated, I would say. It was set up with, like, all these croissants, drinks. It was, like, really nice and chill. It seemed to be, like, kind of, like, gather and chat kind of vibe. Um, yeah, it was really early. I was the first one there. I actually have a habit of doing that. I have a habit of being, like, the first one at an event. I've now come to know, now that I've been to, like, maybe three different kind of events, Everyone comes like half an hour late <laughs> and I'm there like three minutes early and it's just me. So awkward. Anyways, I'll show you guys what they gave me. Some beautiful flowers. Stunning. No, it's like just little, but it's actually a beautiful touch. Obviously it's spring. And then these are the jeans that I tried on that I love. The way my jaw dropped when I tried these on and they fit so well. So they're the Yoko. I swear I said Yoko somewhere here. The Yoko jeans, so comfortable. You know when people are like, oh my God, these jeans are so comfy. I'm always like, why are you lying? Like, jeans are not comfy. What are you talking about? These are comfy, and I'm not lying. Anyways, I am really grateful for these jeans. Also got a matcha, which is also a really nice touch. Anyways, thanks for coming along. Um, I'm now severely early, so I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't really want to go home. But, and it's like such a beautiful day, I don't really know what to do. We bring to the interview, because it's just down the road and I don't think I'll be able to find parking if I drive. Um, pick me up, please. So I'm back 
home now. I have like probably like an hour before I will leave for my Pilates class. Um, I'm starving, so I'm gonna eat something. But that interview went really well, so well. Like I'm really happy with how it went. So fingers crossed. You know all the things. I haven't hydrated all day. Oh, today's been such a weird day all over the place. <laughs> week has really taken it out of me so I'm just resting today like bed like head to the bed kind of thing um, and then tonight I'm going out for dinner with my brother to hopefully get some ramen last night my friend and I went out for dinner at this Japanese restaurant called Genzo and we were really after some ramen but they didn't sell it so I'm still craving it. So I'm gonna try again tonight. I wanted to give you guys a little update as well. I wanted to let you guys know that I got the job. I got the job that I went to the interview for. Um, I actually went to two interviews. You didn't really see. Actually, yeah, I started off the vlog having done an interview and then I went to another one the next day. So I did two interviews and I got both jobs. So, I'm really excited, I'm really happy. I just wanted to share that because it was a big week. It was like a little bit, a little bit of a stressful week. And I just wanted to like, I just needed some good news. I just was not feeling great. I had come off the back of being sick and I was just like, ran down. I wanted some positive news in my life after getting that negative I guess rejection from the first job I tried for. I guess things just yeah work out in the in the way that they're supposed to. I I'm no longer sad about that other role because I know that it's not really meant for me right now in this moment, and that's okay. So yeah, on to better, bigger and better things, I guess. But yeah, as I said, I'm like exhausted. I literally don't want to do anything today i'm probably just gonna there are kids living in my building and they're so loud i'm probably just gonna edit this video right now chill have some lunch and then go out for dinner with my brother tonight to get some ramen but yeah it's a really nice day today but i really can't bring myself to exit this house like i need my muscles to repair I've shredded them this week with Pilates and walking and just stress. So, yeah. Okay. So loud out there. Um, I think I'm just going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching um, and coming along my journey in Sydney. It's Definitely different to what I'm used to and I'm still trying to get used to just the hustle and bustle of Sydney. I don't know if it's for me right now, but I'm trying my best to keep up. So yeah, lots more fun to come. 
I really appreciate every single one of you and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!